It's main event time. They sound ready to me, Kim. Gosh. Mentioned earlier in the show, this is Jesse's Divide. They are a local band and they are playing live. They're playing live to bring Sexy Kev, the challenger, to the ring. Sexy Kev, his catchphrase is, damn I'm sexy and you might not like him but unfortunately, he kind of is. He's in the bit I, I am the beholder, so he's not my type. He's the kind of man who's so arrogant about his body. <laughs> and I, I guess I'm just, I, uh, he, he says, uh, you know, people like me are jealous, and I, I, maybe I am a little bit. But if I had a body like that, I'd have a bit of, I'd have a bit of dignity, maybe a bit of a bit of humility, but Sexy Kev, he even calls himself Sexy Kev, not just Kev, Sexy Kev. Look at the way he's gyrating around Kim Rocks. So we've got a challenger. We need a champion. Jesse's Divide, bringing Keith Meyer to the ring. Now, Kim Rocks called him the Stoke Cold Stunner. Do you want to know who named Keith Meyer's manoeuvre the Stoke Cold Stunner? That would be me, Magic Mark. That, that, that's 15 points for me, I think. And I'll tell you something, if Keith Meyer hits that Stoke Cold Stunner, it will be one, two, three, and a retain of the belt that he is holding high. So, it's Keith Myers, our champion, after his incredible victory at the last show, defeating the almost unbeatable Wild Boar, Stokes Hero. He's not the youngest boy, but my goodness, he's still got, he's still got it where it counts. He's a brawler, he's a fighter, he's a warrior. He's got a rude word on his t-shirt, and he is the pro wrestling for you, heavyweight champion. Keith, the master of the Stoke Gold Stunner. Taking on Sexy Kev. Keith's first title defense. And listen, listen to the fans. Listen to the affection they have for this man. And listen to the lack of affection they have for that man. I mean, what does Sexy Kev think's going to happen? 